Hello students, welcome back to online classes of St. Thomas High School. So today we are going to start new lesson, lesson number 4, simple equations. So let us understand what is the equation. If I write 4x, 4x plus 5, it is written here only, I am making this circle, you can check. If I write 4x plus 5, is it an equation? No, this is expression, okay. This is not equation, but if I write 4x plus 5 is equal to 1, then this is the equation. 4x plus 5 only, this is the expression and 4x plus, 4x plus 5 is equal to 1, that is a equation. Okay, now you can see here sign is given. It is a sign of equal. It means equality sign is there. That's why it is named as, a, as an equation. If there is a sign of less than or greater than, then also it is not an equation. It is written here. You can check 4x plus 5 is greater than 65 is it is not an equation what is the meaning of this sign equal if I write 4x plus 5 is equal to 1 then meaning of this sign is that both the sides are equal left side and right side you can check here it seems that both sides are not same 4x plus 5 is equal to 1 how it's possible no that uh, one side it, it is given in the form of variable 4x where x is an variable and other side 1 it is given that is a constant but though therefore both sides are same and the meaning of this sign and here it is less than both sides it does not show that both the sides are same so it is not showing an equation Now exercise 4.1, question number 1, complete the last column of the table. What is the equation, uh, what is the question, sorry. Here, equation given and the value of this equation is given. You have to say whether the equation is satisfied or not. How we can find out this one? Actually, 4x plus 5, same example I am taking here is equal to 1 where x is a variable. Value of this x can vary. It can be 0, 1, 2, 3, minus, positive numbers, negative numbers, 0. It can be anything. Okay. If I put value of x, any value, and I solve this equation, then if I get here 1, then we can say 1 is equal to 1. Here this sign, it means equal it means left side is should be equal to right side or right side as right side should be equal to left one but you can check here right side it is given one it means after putting the value of x here on the left side you should get answer one so one is equal to one then this condition is satisfied value of x is a correct so if i put x is equal to minus one in this given equation let's put 4 here x is in multiplication so here minus 1 plus 5 is equal to 1 now 4 into minus 1 so it becomes minus 4 plus 5 is equal to 1 okay so minus 4 plus 5 is equal to 1 minus 4 plus 5 is equal to now you can write 5 minus 4, you can interchange, okay, commutativity, property that you can change their order is equal to 1. 5 minus 4, 1 is equal to 1. Yes, here you got 1 is equal to 1. So value of x is equal to minus 1 is 
satisfied for this equation. This way how to do the sum. For value x is equal to 3, check here what is the equation? x plus 3 is equal to 0. Value of x you have to put 3. It means 3 plus 3 is equal to 0. 3 plus 3 is equal to 6 is equal to 0. So, 6 is not equal to 0 actually. Okay. So, here answer is no. First answer is no. Second one x is equal to 0. So, if you will if you will put x is equal to 0, it means 0 plus 3 is equal to 0. 0 plus 3 it means 3 is equal to 0. 3 is equal to 0? No. Again, second answer is no. Now, x is equal to minus 3. Here you will put minus 3 instead of x. Minus 3 plus 3 is equal to 0. So, on the left side solve it 3 minus 3 0. 0 is equal to 0. So, yes, your answer is yes. You can check here no, no and yes. Now, x is equal to 7. So, here instead of x put 7. Solve the left side 7 minus 7 0. Then 0 is equal to 1. Again, it is not correct. So, equation is not satisfied. Okay. This way you have to calculate all the sums. Now, let us do this sixth one. What is the value of x? x is equal to 0. So, 5 into x. It means 5 into 0. So, 5 into 0 is equal to 0. So, your left side it becomes 0. And on the right side, there is a 25. Is 0 is equal to 25? No. So, answer is here no. Now, next one. 5x is equal to 25. So, put the value of x is equal to 5. Here I am doing 5 into 5 is equal to 25. Here, what I have to do? Sorry, what you have to do? Whatever equation is there 5x is equal to 25? This is the question or equation value of x is equal to 5. So, here on the left side you have to put the value 5 and this equal sign as it is 25 as it is. Multiply this two no numbers 5 into 5. So, you will get 25. Okay. So, here 25 then equal sign as it is 25 as it is. You got same answer on the both sides. So, it means answer is yes. So, in short you have to put the value of x in the equation and after solving the equation, if you are getting both the sides same, then you have to write answer yes. If you are getting different answer, if both the sides are not equal, then you have to write the no. Okay. So, remaining examples, try yourself. Here also same thing is there. Check whether the value given in the brackets is a solution to the given equation or not. Same thing as we have done in the question number 1. Put the value of variable in the equation. First one, n plus 5 is equal to 19 where n is equal to 1. So, n plus 5, n is equal to 1, 1 plus 5. So, 1 plus 5 is equal to 6. What is the right side is equal to 19? 6 is equal to 19? No, both are different. So, left hand side and right hand side is not the same. So, n is equal to 1 is not the solution of the given equation. Second one, 7n plus 5 is equal to 19 where n is equal to minus 2. Putting n is equal to minus 2 in a left side. Why? Because your variable is given on the left side. So, 7 into minus 2 plus 5 is equal to minus 14 plus 5. 7 into 2 minus 14 plus 5 as it is. Now, 14 minus 14 plus 5 is equal to minus 9. So, what is the right side? 19 and what you got here left side? Minus 9. Both are not same. So, it is not the solution of given equation. Okay. So, remaining examples we will see in the next video lecture.